Yeah, I did the story uh, about a, a company and a family, Adam's uh, family, that has bought a bunch of newspapers. And uh, the trick was they've never talked to the media and uh, certainly weren't going to talk to me. But uh, the two things I found were that you can get that story together if you look hard for different sources and also um, go to people who, who knew them. And, and one of the things that surprised me just a little bit, I tend to be suspicious of people who won't talk to the media, but uh, many of the people at the companies they bought say they're terrific, they invest in, uh, in news, and uh, they're a very positive force in the industry. Google searches are a good place to start. Um, there tur it turned out that uh, uh, another group uh, at the UNC uh, Chapel Hill, which specializes in small newspapers, had done a similar kind of story without uh, their cooperation. But the, the most crucial thing was that uh, the head of the company had given a talk to uh, one of the newspaper associations. In some way, that, was, uh, that PowerPoint was up uh, on the internet. So that provided the basic kinds of information you get in an interview. It's a really be resourceful, don't, uh, don't quit right there, and uh, uh, check, check just a variety of different sources. And, and, and as happens in reporting, uh, one thing leads to another to another.